psychic reading on Diddy's alleged sex trafficking. As you all know, there is a F no Homeland Security raid on both his homes in LA and Miami. So let's get into it. We're Trinity Oracles, we're psychic sisters. I'm trying to get through this fast so we can give y'all the tea. <laughs> I'm Jack. This is Erica and this is Candace. If you guys want to book your own personal reading, links in the description box below. You want to enroll in the Oracle Card Readers Academy, learn how to read cards just like us. Links in the description box below. And make sure you read our celebrity and predictions blog to mm -hmm. read more celebrity predictions that we put out. All right, so. Talk about turkey. Huh? Bring on the turkey thing. Oh, this on the blog. There's a, there's a, a blog post about turkey. So please, please check, check it out. It's very important. Yes. So let's get started. First question is, thank you, um, our family, uh, YouTube family, for putting out these questions. So guys, that's a great questions. question. They said our Diddy's sons were handcuffed at his property, I think, in L.A., Someone asked, are Diddy's sons into Diddy's lifestyle? Mm. And if so, were they willingly in were they were they willingly into his lifetime? Will they were they willingly into his lifetime or were they forced to be in his lifestyle? That's a good question. And I think it was Justin and Christian were the ones who were handcuffed outside the property when they raided. Um Willingly and they're not as involved as people may think. And they keep showing Justin has his own type of different lifestyle going on than what people may think yeah he they keep saying he's not involved heavily that's what my cards are showing even all of them come in reverse even this is my life purpose like lifestyle life purpose i get reverse no 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 i gotta know too they dibble and dabble into certain things but they're not into it like people think they're into it because of their dad they're thinking oh they're like it's like mm -hmm. yeah father like son they're like no it's interesting. I keep getting, I got the notes too, but like they will say things and they don't think their dad like takes it seriously. Like, oh, let's, let's do this. And Diddy's like, okay, let's do that. They don't think it's going to, was going to come to fruition until it actually does. Mm. So they might say some, give ideas or something like that, but they're not fully involved with this whole ordeal. But I will tell you this though, things will be coming out of the shadows about Justin and, and what's that boy's name? King? Christian, I think. Christian, Christian or King, whatever. But anyway, there's Quincy, the older one. And there's D just Justin, and Justin is the one that looks just like Diddy. Okay, mm -hmm. things will be coming mm -hmm. out of the shadows. Okay, the one that doesn't look like Diddy, the light Christian skin one with the curly hair. Yeah, is that Christian? I yeah, that's. Anyway. Or I don't know. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> let us know <laughs> who's the dark skin one and who's the light skin one. I don't know. Anyways, <laughs> the one, the two that were handcuffs. Let us know in the comments. But, <laughs> but. Um, they keep showing them over the curly hair, the light skin one that was in cuffs. There's something about him having a different, like, alternative lifestyle that's going to come out. But just stuff coming out of the shadows about Diddy's. Diddy has four sons or three? Well, the oldest one, Quincy, that's not his child, but he raised him. But, I mean, does he have four sons or is it only three? I think it's just three. I think it's just three. I'm curious if Diddy has a fourth. But, anyways, things will be coming out of the shadows about their lifestyle choices and things like that. Okay? Mm. Wow. Okay. Okay. And it's about their alternative lifestyles and stuff like that. Okay. So, next question. Is Diddy going to get arrested for this um, uh, federal raid? There's nothing to do with Cassie. People want to know, is he going to get arrested? Exactly. Because some people are like, oh, is he going to prison for Cassie? No. He's mm -hmm. not going to prison for the Cassie thing. That was settled. That was civil. This is a different reading based on, is he going to prison based on this raid? Okay, because we did a reading prior and people were like, well, did he go into prison over this Cassie thing? And we said no, and which he did it. So we want to make sure this is very clear. Okay, mm -hmm. there is a distinction. They said Diddy actually is going to get arrested. They said Diddy, Diddy will be arrested, but he's going to be posting bail very quickly. Yep. Yeah, yeah, he can't escape the handcuffs, so the spirit said. Okay, so oh, okay. he is going to be standing trial. And there is very strong evidence against Diddy. Mm -hmm. He is not going to be able to withstand this. He's like, oh my God, oh my God. But you know what? Spirit says incriminating stuff. Like stuff. Yes. They're bringing out stuff from the past. They they're being deep. They keep showing him, then bringing him stuff. And he's like, I don't even remember that. That's not me because there's so much Lil, stuff. Lil Rod helped them tremendously. Oh, wow. He is the main, I don't want to say he's the main reason, but... He helped Homeland Security tremendously. If you don't know about Little Rod, Little Rod is the producer or up and come producer that was with Diddy for an entire year. And he said that Diddy showed him basically like his whole ulterior lifestyle. He showed him all 
where all his drugs were, his guns were allegedly, wow. and that he said that he actually has incriminating footage on his own personal cell phone and knows all this stuff about Diddy. So that he's suing for thirty million dollars, also just like Cassie. Mm -hmm. And there's <laughs> other people who, who allegedly, also, yeah. There's other witnesses and stuff who are going to be helping this uh, this case and kind of giving this stuff. But you know what? We're going to see if Diddy's going to go to prison, but we're going to we're going to wait on that. We're not going to answer it right now because we got some other juicy questions and then we'll we'll get to that a little yeah, towards. There's a lot of you questions. Know. Okay, <laughs> Thank so you guys are asking a great question. Why are no other celebrities talking about this whole Diddy fiasco? Well, 50 Cent is. 50 is the one. Aubrey O'Day did. She put out like, oh, something you reap what you sow. Ooh, she also said okay. with Tupac, she said with Tupac, I don't want people to say not too soon. How about it's a little too late? Oh. Yeah. And then also, who else said something? 50 Cent, Cassie, and there was somebody else who says something. I can't remember who she oh, is, that. but it's another young lady who um, spoke out. Okay, mm. I didn't know that. Okay, so what other celebrities actually, so other celebrities actually tied to this Diddy case? Ooh. What other could be going down with well, Diddy? Mm. Prince saw this morning, Prince Harry, they named him. They, they named drop him. It was on the New York, York Post, Post that he's tied to the $30 million lawsuit by Little Rock, right? right? Is that one of them parties? I think so, yeah. I just saw him in a picture of Diddy, like, you know, bro hugging it out. He's like, like, younger, though. Like, yeah. Actually, he, looked, he was probably like 20 something, early 20s. And 20. then Diddy was like, oh, I got to go fly out to Harry and catch up with him. Oh. He's a real cool guy, and I hope he takes me to one another. He's named some type of club. I hope we can go oh, out and man. you know when hang he, out. What did he say? He says in the past. What? Yeah, sometime in the past or whatnot. So, mm. so did he even get freaky deaky with the Royals? Maybe. Um, Sounds <laughs> you're like it. saying how you say other celebrities involved. For some reason, Dame Dash gets thrown oh, into the mix. Wow. I don't know. Did him and Diddy know each other? I'm not too sure about good. that, but they keep saying Dame Dash. They are, they are. Or Dame and Dash or Dame Dash. You say he could be named in mm. this. Name dropped. This is the end of Revolt officially. What's Revolt? Isn't that his channel or his thing? Uh, I don't know. know. What is Carisha on? Carisha. I don't know. Like, I no, but isn't it part oh, of no Revolt? Clue. Like Revolt is a production company or something? Not, I, I, have no clue. I, don't, I just know what's the clothing line, but that was years ago, but I'm not yeah, sure. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure it's Revolt. Whatever, let us know. <laughs> whatever Diddy's production company, even though they, I think he's been let go or something like that, but this is the end. Like, no more. Okay, Spirit mm -hmm. just said though there's gonna be name drops, name bombs. They keep saying name drops, like people are not gonna drop. They said off the footage and whatever they find from Diddy's properties, they're gonna be naming like celebrities. Mm. Wow. Like, oh, this person's at this party doing this illegally, yada, yada, yada. Mm. So, yeah. they keep bringing up Mary J. Blige might get tied into this too. Oh my. Uh oh. Wow. Mm -hmm. But it is in limited capacity with Mary J. Blige. Yes. When you said that her spirit said limited capacity. Um, Allegedly. <laughs> 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 there's some other known rappers being brought into this too. So yeah, there's whew. other people. It was like, wait, they were, they did that? Mm -hmm. Did they enter that lifestyle? <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. So um, someone asked, what exactly? Oh, they already asked what they're looking for. Is someone asked, is Little Rod, the producer, telling the whole truth or is he exaggerating? Because mm. he said he has hundreds of hours worth of footage on his cell phone of incriminating stuff about Diddy and all the illegal stuff he allegedly does. I'm getting he has very incriminating stuff. They keep saying all the stuff he alleges that he has, all this evidence and all the stuff that he's alleging. Tell the truth about that. It is going to be proven. Like, he has the footage behind it. Yep. So that's the definite yes. The Diddy, Lil Rod is gonna be getting death threats though. I, I got this. Mm. I got this card. The death card. They said yes. I got definitely yes. But he's not gonna die. But he is gonna be getting it's some like death Kobe threats. Him. I think that I think I read something the other day. They said that his he said that his daughter is getting harassed. I don't know how oh, old his daughter wow. is, but he's, that's what he said. So the Diddy's daughters know about his ulterior lifestyle. His daughter, so his daughters. He has oh, he has oh, four daughters. Three now. Now. He has three. Well, he has adult, adult oh, they're like yeah, grown. Yeah. The other one's a baby, so she don't know anything. Mm -hmm. She might. The baby, <laughs> they pay attention. <laughs> um, so did they know? His daughters um, know about his lifestyle. Um, I'm getting a no. He keeps them shielded from that. This is the card that I got. He keeps them shielded from that. From that, if somebody does might mention something, he's like. Don't listen to what they what they're saying. Yeah, like they they like they're like, 
Like, their spirit guys are saying, like, they know their dad's wild. Yeah. But they don't know To the extremities. <laughs> yes. Like... They're like, what about Jekyll and Mr. High? He shows a completely different face to his children. Literally. And they say when they get older, they find they're going to be like, our dad did that. Like, mm -hmm. we didn't even know. Yep. He has a completely different person when he's around them. Yep. Wow. Okay. Um, someone asked, how, how the Fed been watching Diddy for a while? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm getting a, like a yes, but a no. Um, but they're saying that the person, for some reason, I don't know. They keep showing like somebody that works for Diddy, not like within the music industry. There might be like a maid, a, somebody that like works a mole. In, No, I, I wouldn't say that. They keep showing like this woman, she sees stuff and then she's like, oh, or she might walk into a room and see something. But they say she's a, around the home. So yeah, but it's that's yeah. The, the question is have the feds been watching for a long time. She I got, said, I got, she's part of the feds, like undercover. I I thought there's something that happened at the house that she might have called the police for. She's like, oh, make sure to check on this. Mm. But when this guy opened up the <laughs> Pandora's box, literally, they're like, oh, we should have been paying more attention because this lady did say something to us years ago mm -hmm. about mm -hmm. stuff going on in that house. Okay. Oh. I thought that they, they got the feds actually haven't watched him for a while, but they keep saying that they had like he's so protected They mm -hmm. had actually no evidence that they couldn't do anything about it. Yep, but they have been watching him for a while mm -hmm. This has been years in the making and I would not never mind, I'd say, well, Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Some things are best <laughs> kept, kept. <laughs> Exactly. Wow. <laughs> okay, so any of it, um, the, uh, this whole thing goes to court or to trial, where his kids have to be witnesses against their father. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Because allegedly, Little Rod said that one of his sons was involved in human trafficking, and he mm. has the footage to actually show that too. Mm. Mm -mm. That he was supplying underage minors to Diddy's wild parties. I'm getting a yes. Those ki the one of those sons will have to be on the stand, saying what he saw. Unfortunately, he will have to be there. I'm getting a yes. I'm getting a definite yes too. But they show one one child, one of Diddy's kids. Mm -hmm. I yes. Um. Oh Lord have mercy. Um. Yeah. Um. His kids. Some of his kids will have to be witnesses at his trial. Um. One of them is more into his, one of the sons is more into his lifestyle than the other two boys. Hmm. One of them is almost like a mini Diddy. He's very like egotistical. He loves the power that comes being Diddy's son. Like he's more into this lifestyle. Or just hanging around his dad. He knows his dad does this. And he's just like, whatever. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's an ego trip for him. Mm -hmm. I do see Diddy making a last ditch attempt to save his um it's like safe, safe face safe face That's safe crazy. his empire like um i wouldn't be shocked if diddy maybe doesn't like they keep showing like save his relationships save his connections to the industry mm. um safe face um show up more with his kids oh. um like he's just gonna be doing like this one last ditch attempt before it all goes down um diddy and his children were supposed to be having a hulu series kind of like the kardashians I want to know, is that still going to happen? No, it's already been canceled. Oh, it was canceled. Oh, yeah. okay. It was canceled happened. beforehand. Yeah, it was canceled. It was canceled with the Cassie situation? I can't remember, um, but I, I just saw it today that it's, uh, Hulu had already said, like, I guess a couple months ago or recently or something like that. Anymore. But, Diddy, this, you're, you're done. Diddy's done. Man, is Bad Boy Records done? It's been done. This is Danny Kane. I'm just Danny Kane. There's no coming back, Diddy. This last ditch attempt, your published nothing, nothing is bringing you back. Wow. At all. Mm. This is a nail in the coffin. So, exactly. Next question. So, will any uh, will Diddy or any of his children have to face jail time, or prison, or prison? Wow. From what this federal raid uncovers, I don't get prison time. I don't see prison time. Mm, I get it. I get for it. the kids. Yeah, I get. I get a um, dodging prison time. I I get that. But this will for this the kids, whoever no. does get whoever has to come and speak up. They said that it's over for them too. 
so. What do you mean over for know, them? What does that mean? Their reputation, like, well, that's Diddy's son. Instead of having the notoriety, oh. people are like, I don't want to. Like, I don't want to associate. I don't. I don't want to associate with him anymore. We were friends, but since this and this happened, I can't be your friend anymore. That type of thing. Oh, okay, okay. I actually gain that Diddy actually will face jail time for whatever um, allegations that the feds find. I'm actually, I'm getting he actually is going to face jail or prison. I give him jail time. Well, you're jumping into Diddy, not the kids. Okay. Oh, I, we were talking I about said the kids. either or. I'm talking, for the kids, I got to know. For Diddy, I got a yes. Diddy's going to prison. Diddy's not going to jail. Ooh. Jail is less than one year. Yeah, his kids are. Prison is 365 and more. 364 and below is one is jail. <laughs> 365 one and year above for is prison. No, no, I'm making a distinction oh. for people. Yeah. Oh. Because 364 days or less is jail. jail 365 oh, or more that. is prison. Diddy will be serving prison time. For many years to come. Mm. Uh oh. His kids will be petrified being out of the limelight. Wow, really? Hmm. Mm. Because they're basically blacklisted. Mm. They are shunted. Makes sense, yeah. They go in their favorite hotel. Everybody's looking at them like, your dad, ooh. You they, can't get a room here. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. We don't want to associate with them. You know, even though they're very well protected, they're going to get taken care of. They feel petrified of being out of the limelight. Hmm. Yeah, they keep spooky fan. They're like, there's so there's so much incriminating evidence that there's no way he's not going to be able, not going to jail. Exactly. So someone asked a great question. They said, "How does Kim Porter feel about this?" Mm. Kim Porter is his um, deceased child's mother. I think she had three kids with him, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and they're opening up the investigation. They think that Diddy allegedly might have even had something to do with her death. Mm. So that New York City, New York is actually investigating, reopening her case. Mm. And Tamarly Simmons said something too about it because they were best friends. Let's see, Kim Porter. Um, She's very scared for her kids, her daughters. Um, is the one that the dark skin one? That's her son. That's her son. That's her son. Just okay. like Diddy. Okay. He looks just like She's him. She's very nervous about her kids. Um, She's very scared, scared for their mental and emotional well-being. She's yes. very like, oh my God, like, who's going to take care of my kids now? I exactly. And she's like frantic. Exactly. I wonder if her mother's still alive. They're like, she's trying to contact her mother to like swoop in and get my kids. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's what she, yeah, so I don't know if we're wrong. Shh. For Diddy, she don't care because she's like, he's pure evil. Yeah. So yeah, she's like, I guess that's about too. darn time. I got my like justice. Like, finally, mm -hmm. finally something comes out about him. But she keeps saying, do not trust Aubrey O'Day. She's up to something. That's what oh, Cam wow. says. She's like, do not trust Aubrey O'Day. She's up to something. Mm. Wow. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yep. And she's trying to get through to her kids. And I keep hearing her say, cry, cry. Like, letting them know it's okay to cry. Wow. Go see therapy because they really are scared for their dad because they really are daddy's girls. Yeah. I got one mm -hmm. of the daughters specifically. They keep showing one of the, I don't know their names, but one of the twins being scared. But then the other one, and they show her for some reason on social media trying to distract people. Maybe put out a video. Maybe show mm -hmm. her. I don't know. They just keep showing that and people are not going to like that either. Like this is what is going on and you're making a, a, TikTok. a TikTok or something dancing. Mm -hmm. Like, what are you doing? The other one's just going to be like, I don't want to be on there. Yeah. But all in all, Kim Porter is actually happy. She keeps saying victory finally. Mm -hmm. So she's, like, she's actually Justice. happy. It's happening, but she's very scared for her kids. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. Wow. Yeah. So, thank you guys for watching this video. We might be doing a part two, so stay Oh, wait, hold on. I wanted to say this, oh. though. Okay. Carisha is not going to be incriminated from this. Carisha's from the City Girls, or is it JT? Which I don't know. Know. Whoever the one from the girl, City, yeah, City Girls that's connected, she is not going to Carisha, be incriminated please. in this. Okay, so I know some of you guys are wondering, oh my God, is she going to go to prison, or is she like, I don't see that. Is her name going to be brought up? Yes. Is there a potential she's brought in as a witness or will be interrogated? Mm -hmm. Even if she's not a witness, she's going to be interrogated along with Diddy's other uh, cronies. That's what Kim Porter said, along with his other cronies Ooh. and his other women. 
There's more lawsuits to come for Diddy. You I'm know, sorry. I, I, there's a great question I want to ask. Um, 50 Cent said he's going to make a, uh, a documentary called, uh, what is it? Something Diddy? What is it? Surviving, Surviving oh Diddy. God. Is he actually going to make it? Because people are like, is he joking? People are like, is he really going to make a documentary? Because <laughs> he, he was saying stuff about Diddy years ago. Mm -hmm. He said Diddy tried to take him like shopping He said Diddy tried to take him on a date and he was just like, why are you trying to take him on a date? <laughs> but he's been saying stuff about Diddy. I guess people thought he was joking. He's like, no, I'm not joking. He was like, that's weird that is funny so will he actually make the documentary um i got no i got no documentary will be made he's toying with the idea this is 50 cent with his hands together like hmm i'm gonna maybe maybe i should put this out there um this is good it's like a tease yeah i got he's like, 50 cent just like to them. pick at people you think just messing with them dang diddy prison prison for a long time you're going to be held responsible for your actions and by the way wow just like r kelly oh this yeah. reminds me of r kelly and we actually did a reading on r kelly and said that he was going to get prison so did someone say that we we said something about diddy i don't know i think someone said that we said something I guess somebody said we predicted let us know if we ago. did say that what video that was we don't remember everything. yeah <laughs> but yeah so with that book a reading with trinity oracles um, i'm jasmine this is erica and that is candace and uh look forward to part two peace peace Bye.